Hi, my name is Kevin Strawn. I'm a retired police inspector, having done 32 years in the Metropolitan Police. I first came across restorative justice 20 years ago and have seen it being used and facilitated it myself in recent times for many, on many, many occasions. Why is it important for victims to have access to restorative justice? Well, it's a very, very important option, a tool in the box, as we say. Of course, I totally believe in the criminal justice system, but this absolutely goes hand in hand with it. It's not for me or anyone else to say whether restorative justice is the right thing. It has to be for the victims themselves. The best people to ask are those that have been victims, unfortunately, and have been offered and accessed and gone through the process of restorative justice. They're the people that can truly and honestly tell you what it feels like. So what might change if this bill were to come into effect? Well, there's two things really I've noticed over the last 20 plus years, and that was if the people at the top of an organisation or institution don't buy into something, so we'll take restorative justice as an example, then it really stands no chance at all. I've experienced it. We once had a deputy commissioner who came out and said, I don't believe in restorative justice. And thus everyone below him didn't really get the support that was required. Therefore, the bill means that the government and people right at the top are saying this is important and this needs to be offered. So this bill needs to show that from the very top government that they support it and they have trust and confidence in the people that can deliver and many many more victims can move on with their lives it's said about many things but this truly does deliver in that sense so let's let's get out there let's get the people at the top let's get this bill in let's get it offered to everyone none of us know whether we're going to be a victim tomorrow or not so it could be us let's get the cases flowing let's get this up and running not only five percent of victims offered it there are always answers to any problem and restorative justice is one of them